All right, you two peoples. If you're enjoying the journey on this 66 Volkswagen and some of my other vehicles I work on from time to time, got some more coming up, hit that subscribe button for me and help me out here on YouTube. <clears throat> anyway, the progress right now is spent the entire day, hours and hours and hours, compounding this vehicle some more trying to pick out trouble spots improve those as best i could but i have completely done compounding it there are some spots that they're just not enough paint according to the paint thickness gauge or the paint is damaged and cannot be improved anymore than what it already is but overall i'm fairly pleased with it uh, among other things, I was a little disappointed in the roof. Yeah, I know it looks pretty good from back here. Like I said, it might pass the four-foot test, but I don't know what happened to the roof. I, I guess them car washes and somebody got a hold of it with a big buffer and they tried to use the same buffer for the entire car. I didn't even use my big buffer on this car at all. I used a five-inch and even smaller, the Nano Polishing buffer kit whatever you call it and there's lots of buffer burns all over this car from whoever did that doing it but uh, overall it's it, it's it's turned out pretty fair not too bad for an old 66 with a El Cheapo paint job on it and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start finishing it the finish polish, the finishing polish, finishing down as we call it. And uh, I'm gonna use a Lake Country black finishing pad. It's very, very soft. Just, just a very little bit of polishing action on there. And um, I think the product I'm gonna use is Sonex Perfect Finish, I think they call it. If I can find it, it's around here somewhere. Yep, Sonex Perfect Finish. You can see I got the plastic bag on there. That that helps keep it sealed, keeps the air from getting to it and making your product go bad. Kind of pricey, but really good stuff, folks. But okay, we'll tune out for now and pick this journey back up later. Thank y'all very much for dropping by. I appreciate it. And Gary, buddy, I think I'm on the downhill slope now with your car. Hopefully it'll be done. Well, this part will be done soon. I still got to do the aluminum trim, the pieces I've removed from the car. And I got to do the glass. And I got to wash it again, which will just be a quick maintenance wash. Just spiff up the tires and wheels a little bit. And maybe a few other things, depending on what time frame we're looking at here. <laughs> but these windows are nasty from all this dusting from all this. Okay, folks. See y'all later. Gonna go in and eat some supper now. <laughs>